The inquiry began this morning. Present were representatives from the National Housing Corporation led by MD John Dege. Finance was represented by Acting Secretary Semana Supe Zurenok and Lands Department Secretary Romilly Kilapet. There were few exchange of words as Chairman Hickey questioned Mr. Dege why documents requested by the committee earlier were not delivered, but Mr. Dege maintained he provided everything. Chairman, what is happening? Because I did not do you a favor? No. Seriously, you've got to get to the facts of it. Yes. I've got all the evidence here. If you want to well, give me the quick. evidence. We're talking Mr. now about... I've been there for nine months. You called me four times to this Yes. PAC. Yes. I delivered everything you want in truck loads. Chairman Hickey was concerned that there was insufficient or missing records to know the status of National Housing Corporation, let alone the number of properties sold or are yet to be sold, and titles transferred under the different housing schemes. 70 million, and the finance department says 36. So there's thousands of people that have been paying rent and their rent money is lost, gone, finished. And that means there's no record of them having paid rent for the properties that they've been occupying, some of them for more than 30 years. PAC committee member and Northern Governor Gary Jufa used the opportunity to raise concerns about the housing manager in Popondetta. He claims the manager is not performing his duty. You know, he's, he's a ghost who walks. No one knows who he is, or what he looks like, or where he is most of the time. So I'm, I'm assuming that there must be some means by which you are having an oversight of the management of those, depart, uh, de, uh, those branches throughout the country. In response, Mr. Dagger said since taking office, he had to clean up the mess of past management at the corporation and enforce strict guidelines. When I first moved in, I called a uh, provincial manager's uh, uh, conference and then I gave them a stern warning that this should not be the case anymore. So I'm slowly getting there. The National Housing Corporation is currently undergoing its valuation exercise in general on all assets and properties to validate all NHC properties. It is also working closely with the Lands Department to align all processes. Bridget Komatep, National MTV News.